Let's get it. Let's get it. These are all. Mm. Head go. Hey, hey, hey. This is heavy. Hi, guys. It's Melissa Q. Welcome back for another video. In this video, I just have a question, first of all. Do you have issues that need tissues when it comes to your hair? Well, in this video, I'm going to share my hair goals for 2019, the tools that I'm going to use to get there, and I'm going to show you some products that I'm loving, and I'm going to show you some things that I just bought in order to get there. Let's go. Before we get into this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button. Mm. I can wait. I can wait. Ay. I can wait. I can wait. I can wait. Ay. I hope you guys enjoy it here. I am on a no buy, low buy, but I am budgeting my hair products. Y'all know I do hair videos. I do natural hair videos. I do hair videos in general because you can be natural straight. You know, you can you can be what you be what you want to be. We talk about hair. We talk about beauty products on this channel. In today's video, we are going to go through my hair goals for 2019 because my kids been sick. I've been sick. Been coughing, hacking. Joseph's not feeling good today. Say hi, Joe. Hi. Yeah, he wasn't feeling good today. But baby's mama, mama baby. Oh. <coughs> So let's talk about my goals, okay, in terms of hair care. And then what am I doing to actually attain those goals? Y'all know I've talked about hair growth. I've talked about repair. And the first thing I want to definitely do is make sure that I have that moisture protein balance. I actually, on my calendar, I keep each and every time I do a protein treatment, I would do one at least once a month. No, I would do it every other month. I think I'm going to up any up and go ahead and do it a protein treatment every month just because I feel like my my hair has been weaker than normal. It is re like it's recovering from having a child, having that postpartum shedding, and I really have been like not in the routine of wearing my twist outs as much as I was before and it allowed me you know protective styling and doing my twist outs my braid outs really helped my hair grow I have high porosity hair y'all already know that is the mo here on my channel and so I know what I need to do moisture protein balance I need to do more protective styling which I do have a twist out under here which is another thing I want to talk about are these slap caps. This is from a brand, Gracie Elise, or something like that. But I will link, leave a link down below. During the holiday months, they had a buy one, get one free. They have it again. And I think I'm going to get two more, which means that I'm getting two for the price of one. I'm going to get these because they are satin lined. I absolutely love this. I sleep in these. I can wear these out. Um... And so I'm going to get more of these, but this is a great way. I do have a silk pillowcase, but sometimes this rubs off. And then even when I want to wear a head wrap, I can put this under it. So there's a couple of reasons why I want to do the slap cap. And I think it's a great investment if you want to retain length because you don't want it rubbing up against, you know, cotton and your ends are the oldest part of your hair so that's the reason why i'm doing that and i also want to do a hair retention or length retention challenge and i did one way back when and that is when i made sure that i was keeping like ingredients strengthening ingredients if you didn't know rosemary is a great strengthening type of um it's an ingredient that strengthens the hair, uh, a natural ingredient that strengthens the hair. So I also was using Nioxin. I've talked about that before. It's a hair booster. I was using it around my edges. I need to use that more often. And these things that I'm changing are things that I know that I've done before for lifestyle. It's not something that I'm just doing as a challenge. I'm challenging myself because I need a booster. You know, it's like when you need to work out, once you start, your body gets used to it and then it becomes a part of your lifestyle the hardest part is starting really so those are the things that i know that i need to do the tools that i need twist outs braid outs using the slap cap you know for protective styling doing a protective styling challenge um i am going to be wearing my hair more in a stretch state 
So you will see like me testing out some tools for heat styling and using hair protectants, which is an obvious thing that I'm going to do. But we'll talk about like my proteins, my strengtheners and my moisturizers, really my deep conditioners, because that's the balance that I need to keep. But I want to show you guys some things that I have been loving. I want to show you two things, actually, and they're both from the drugstore. This one is the Garnier Fructis Smoothing Treatment. This is the One Minute Mask. This is the Avocado Extract. This one is so good. It's a one minute mask, but you can keep it in there longer. You can use it as a deep conditioner and a leave-in. I'm going to come with a full review. I've used over half of this, and um, that's just the MO with me. Y'all are going to know I really don't like doing first impressions. I like to get a thorough, my thorough thoughts of a product and come with a review. Those are the type of reviews that I look for on YouTube. And so those are the ones that I actually want to give to you guys. So this one minute mask, it is really, really good. And it is a vegan formula. So Garnier, I know it's in the drugstore, but this is a, it's 98% natural. And I love that. It's a vegan product. So not testing on animals. Okay, so the next thing is I have been loving this Shea Moisture Weightless Texture Spray. Um, I use this and it has coconut water infused. It has Embe oil and aloe. I really like this. And it's the wet the, from the weight, Weightless Texture I do have the shampoo and the deep conditioner, so look for a review from that. And let's talk about some things this is like it's a haul basically but i want to show you guys what i got in december and then i only purchased about 60 dollars worth of product from naturally curly so i want to show you guys what i got from there this is the head and shoulders now i got this from big lots this is the head and shoulders co-wash it's the moisture care it says it's for textured hair i have an issue with brands that have this on here because there are so many different varieties of textured hair. Like, so what type of textured hair? I don't know. Anyway, this is the Moisture Care with vitamin E, almond oil, and coconut essence. Y'all, I'll, I'll come with a review with this. Because I have been using this. My husband has been using this. And, um, spoiler alert, I like it. But it talks about different things. And y'all know head, head and shoulders is really good if you have dandruff problems, if you have flakiness of the scalp. Um, this is a good product. And I only paid like $2.50 for it from Big Lots. But um, I'm going to see how much it costs. You get 12.8 ounces of product. And so I want to get more into co-washing and cleansing conditioners this year. That really helped wash, I mean, obviously helped wash my hair, but it really helped with the moisture retention balance and not stripping the hair. So um, that I got from Big Lots. Let me show you the other two things that I got from Big Lots. Y'all, I found some Tresemme Naturals. And this is the Radiant Volume Conditioner, but these don't contain silicones. And let me just make sure. That is silicone free. Yes, it's a silicone free conditioner. So I could use this. I have used this as a leave in. Y'all, I'm going back way back. Y'all know Tresemme Naturals. Um, this is the Radiant Volume and this is the Sweet Orange and Lemongrass. My hair really likes this even as a leave in. But I can detangle. I can co-wash my hair with this. And um, it's really good. My hair likes this a lot. And as you can tell, I only paid $4.50 for this. So I'm trying to see where I can find this for you guys. Because if I come with a review, I definitely want to let you guys know where you can get it. And um, yeah. But I got that from Big Lots. Those two bottles. I replenished. This was like buy one, get one free from Ulta. And this is the Maui Moisture Shea Butter Hair Mask. I've talked about this. I have a full review of this on my channel. And so... I got two of these, obviously, because it was buy one, get one free, I believe, or buy one, get one half off. It might have been buy one, get one free. But I got the Heal and Hydrate. My hair loves this. This is glycerin free, silicone free, and my hair absolutely loves this. And I can dual this. And this is a multitasking product um, for me because it duels as a deep conditioner and a leave-in. So I can deep condition with it, 
keep it and then you know rinse it out keep it in my hair I could do it that way um I've been loving this as a leave-in though and it's glycerin free for my glycerin free gal yes okay so the next items I have are from naturally curly but I do have two items that I did replenish this is an OG I miss this so much and my hair grew like a weed my hair loves Camille Rose naturals I'm just gonna say that and so I have the Camille Rose curl love moisture milk <laughs> my hair loves this I got this during the I think New Year's sale but it has rice milk and macadamia oil my hair loves this formula and it is silicone free and it is glycerin free so my hair really likes this it's a great moisturizer I can use this as a leave-in as well these lotions though uh, when it's a it's a moisture milk I love using this to moisturize and seal every night and keep it in my hair you'll see Joseph in the video come here let me fix your hat say hi, hi. he wasn't hi. feeling well he wasn't feeling well today so come on Joe oh give me a kiss You just ate some cheeses. Okay. You gotta go lay down, okay? <coughs> okay. So my hair loves Camille Rose. Okay. I just had to get a little sugar. Okay, so I like co-washes. I like cleansing conditioners. So I wanted to try some that I could recommend to you all that's under like I think ten dollars. So these are under ten dollars. I got this from naturally curly.com or curl mart. And so I actually got the mask from this brand too, but this is the LA Long Aid Naturals. Let me know if you have like used this before, but this is the Manuka Honey and Bergamot Double Cream Moisture Mask. It has panthenol and castor oil in it, and it is for natural process, color treated or heat styled hair. So anybody can use this. And this was under $10. So I want to see how this works. And I got the conditioning cleanser from the same brand. So this is the Manuka Honey and Bergamot Conditioning Cleanser and it has Panthenol, Manuka Honey and Ginseng Extract. And it is for natural process color hair or heat style hair. And it's free from sulfates, parabens, phthalates, paraben, formaldehyde, mineral oil, never been tested on animals. So that's what it says on these. So got those. This is the cleansing conditioner. Now the other two items are cleansing conditioners because I am testing these. I have not opened them, but this is the Sasha Pure Certified Peruvian Sasha Itchy Oil Rehydrating Cleansing <coughs> Conditioner. And I also got the Grow Wash from As I Am. I love their coconut co-wash, but I want to try this Go Grow Wash and it's the Long and Lux Cleansing Cream Conditioner. And it says it's for hair types three and four why just tell me if it's for low porosity and medium hair I have an issue with like hair typing that is, that's another video but um, these are all the cleansing conditioners that I'll be testing these are all Joseph is in the background I know these are all the cleansing conditioners or co-washes that I will be testing and letting you guys know the real deal do I love them leave them everything hey guys so i hope you enjoyed this video comment down below and let me know have you tried any of these items that i showed you are you in love with anything that i didn't show you comment down below let me know and i'll see you in the next video bye guys